Hi friends, Namaste. Welcome to my soul food segment where we cook healthy and tasty yummy recipes from all over the world. Please join in. Let's cook together. It's recipe stir fried chicken noodles. I cook these noodles when my son's friend come home. It's very popular with the kids and no matter how large the portion is, the kids always want more. I'm cooking with my son today, so you may spot small hands stirring in once in a while. Beta wants to practice this once with me in the kitchen before he cooks it for his cooking practical exam at secondary school. Ingredients for four portions, 400 gram egg noodles, you may substitute it with any noodles of your choice. One roughly cut thin chicken breast strips, one cup carrot julienne, half a cup sliced spring onion bulb, half a cup sliced pepper, one fourth cup sliced spring onion stock, two chicken stock cubes, finely chopped spring onion greens for garnish, two tablespoon ginger garlic paste, two tablespoon soy sauce, and two tablespoon vinegar. Salt and pepper powder to taste. Optional is 3 tablespoon flavored aromatic oil. I'm using homemade chili garlic basil olive oil. Boil the noodles in a pan. You may add oil to make sure they don't stick. I don't as I'm going to use the drain water for my plants as plant food. If you boil till the noodles are half cooked and quickly drain the excess water, run the noodles through cold water quickly. This way the noodles will be 60 to 70 percent cooked and won't stick together and remaining cooking will continue in the wok. Heat oil in a pan, sufficient oil to stir fry the wedges only. Add spring onion bulb which is the top part, stir fry. Once the onions are translucent, add chicken, carrot, ginger garlic paste, pepper and continue stir frying. Well, quickly check the noodles. These are half cooked. We'll quickly drain out the excess water and as mentioned earlier, run cold water on the noodles to stop cooking and set it aside. Back to the chicken, add our chicken stock cubes, soy sauce and vinegar. I'm using natural sugar cane vinegar which is less salty. Add salt and pepper powder. Please be mindful when adding salt. We have already added vinegar, soy sauce and stock cubes which already have added salt to our dish earlier. Continue stir frying. Check if chicken is fully cooked. Add center part of the spring onion which is the stalk and mix it in the chicken. The stalk does not require cooking. The heat in the pan is sufficient enough to cook this tender stem quickly. Add the boiled noodles. Mix in with the chicken. Switch off the flame. Add the chili garlic flavored oil. I usually mix in the noodles with fork and ladle so it doesn't go mushy and the strands will stay separate and won't stick together. Cover the lid and let it rest for 5 minutes for the noodles to absorb the sauce and flavors. Garnish it with finely chopped spring onion greens. You can see the noodle strands are nice and fluffy and isn't sticking. Chicken is tender and juicy and veggies are all cooked. Please feel free to make any changes to the recipe as per preference and enjoy it with family and friends. Any questions, you may reach out to me on Instagram or Facebook. Hope you enjoyed this video. Wishing you health and happiness. Om Shanti.